It's, it's Ramadan, Ramadan Ramadan. 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 Yes, Ramadan. that's why. Let's, Let's go. go. Okay, good. No one's here yet. Hey, kids. Let me just tell you something. I'm not really fond of this month, Ramadan. For 30 days, all the kids are so well behaved. For 30 days, all their bad eats are gone. Everyone is so kind. They give extra charity and stuff. How will I ever put up with all this goodness for 30 long days? I know. I will spoil Ramadan. I've had enough. Hey, kids. Elias and Duck are going to talk to you about all these good things. You should do. be respectful. You should be kind. You should be this and that. All this good Ramadan stuff. But let me tell you something. Don't listen to any of it. None of it. It's not true. Be mean, not happy. That is the way of life. Okay, listen, I have to go now. But don't tell Ilyas and Duck I was here. Assalamu alaikum. Hey, friends. I'm Ilyas. And this is my best friend, Duck. Assalamu alaikum, everyone. Welcome back to Ramadan Roundup with Ilyas and Duck live. Are you ready for another episode? We are. Yay! Yay! Friends, today is the sixth day of Ramadan. Thank you for watching us every day. Masha'Allah, it's been only one week and been one week of Ramadan already. Friends, if you're new to the show, welcome and Every episode, we want to improve one thing about ourselves every day so that by the end of Ramadan, we will be awesome together, growing and learning and improving, inshallah. We have fun challenges to do after each episode. Once you complete that challenge, you can earn one of these exciting challenge cards. And guess what? You can collect them all. Yay! Yay! And you can download all the challenge cards through the links that are in the description of this video. Um, Ilyas, my duck senses are telling me that our chat box may have some messages. Uh, sure, duck. Um, we can go ahead and check. And also, everyone, if you're new, did you know that we are live right now? Yes. Tell us your name, your age, and where you're watching from today. If it's the first time that you're watching, let us know that too. We love new friends. Yes, we do. Okay, so I see many friends already um, tell us, telling us where they're from. And, um, and of course, we have you our can also usual friends watching us as well, and they're sending salams. You can also try to guess my favorite flavor of ice cream. <sighs> I, think, I think you have more than one favorite flavor, don't you, Duck? Heh. <laughs> okay. Um, so we have Zahra Hussein Salam. Assalamu alaikum, Zahra. And we have Arena. Assalamu alaikum, Arena. And uh, we also have... Assalamu alaikum, um, the four sisters. Uh, the four sisters from Dubai. I forget their names, but they told us four sisters from Dubai. Remember that yesterday, Duck? Wait a minute, Ilyas. Look at that message. Mr. Mean was here before they came on, and they told us to be mean. Really? Oh, what? Yeah. Mr. Mean was here? That's so weird. Guys, don't listen to him. We know he has a heart deep down inside. Yeah, friends. Don't listen to Mr. Mean. Ramadan is all about goodness and all about improving ourselves. He's going to improve too one day. Guess what, Lukman? One of my favorite ice cream flavors is vanilla. 
you got it right. And Haya, Salam Alaikum Haya and Sumaika. Sumaika is, si Sumaika is six months old and she's watching us. She probably is the youngest fan. And um, Sunaina, Su watching Sunaina from is Dubai. watching as well and she's 11. And Arena is watching us. Faiza Khan is watching us. Salam Alaikum. And baby Zahra. Sakina from Milton, Canada. Hi, Sakina. Hey, Sakina. Assalamu alaikum. So many friends. And uh, we're becoming uh, really close because they're watching us every day and always sending salams. Assalamu alaikum to all of you. We love that you're watching. So now um, we'll let the comments come in and we can go back to them later. Um, we want to highlight today's challenge heroes, Duck. Whoa, more challenge heroes. This is so great. Our friends are already working hard and approving themselves at Ramadan. Yes, they are. Let's take a look at some in action in our new segment called Challenge Heroes. <laughs> So here we can see uh, one of our friends who sent us a picture and they were making some delicious food. So healthy eating, like we said, home cooked meals are better. Healthy eating is great for you. Good job. Thank you for sending us in. And here we have some more friends, again, showing um, um, that they're being mindful that Ramadan is a special month and they're cleaning up their room and working together brother and sister and sister yes cleaning up always makes mommy happy i guess that's about kindness they're being kind to each other and working together as a team we love it when you send videos or pictures of you completing the challenges and after every episode we want to make sure that we highlight our Challenge Heroes segment because that's very important. It means that you are actually working on yourself this Ramadan. Duck, what do you think we should talk about next? Friends, take a video or picture of you completing the challenge after every episode and we will put you in our challenge hero segment because that's because that's what you are a challenge hero and also don't forget to use the hashtags um because those are the hashtags that allow us to see your pictures or videos deeds challenge that's one hashtag and hashtag Ilyas and duck live or hashtag qf ramadan you can even use all three so we can see your posts on social media. And yes, we thank can't you for wait that reminder, Duck. To see more of the videos and pictures you're going to share with us. Duck What Ilias, I can feel my I can feel your chat box buzzing. Let's take a minute to see who's watching us today. How about that? Yes, we have a couple of more friends who's joined us and they're sending their salams. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you for joining us, friends. Aida from Qatar, she's five, and she's sending salam. And um, Haya's already here. Sumaika's already here. Sunaina's here. Zoha's eight years old, and she's watching us. You know, this is so cool. Um, and someone said, Suli said that they love us. We love you back, Suli. And Sahar is sending salams. Someone even said, I love you. Aw, thanks. But they didn't say they love you, Duck. I think they say they are loving us, Ilyas and Duck, both of us. Oh, Yasin is here from Milton, and he's a new friend. Watching us for the first time? Yay. Yay. Wow. Zaid is five years old and he is in the UAE. And Zoha is here. Did we talk about Zoha? 
She's eight. And Razi from Jersey. Razi and Mehdi are both from New Jersey. Assalamu alaikum, Razi and Mehdi. Oh, someone's from Dubai, but go ahead and tell us your name. Zayed is from Dubai and is five. And Soha Shaban is watching us from Doha. And she's nine and she loves duck. Salams to you, duck. She's sending you salams. And Adila. Adila is sending hi. Hello, Adila. Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. We're going to come back. We're going to let the comments just keep on flowing in. And we're going to come back to our friends before the end of the show. Thank you for all your comments. Why are you smiling so much, Duck? Because you said thank you to our friends. That is so respectful. Yes, Duck. Saying things like please and thank you are important parts of being respectful. Actually, Duck, that's our topic for today. Respect. Respect. And after today's episode, you will have a chance to collect this challenge card, friends. Ooh, that's nice. I want one. Oh. Someone is calling. Who could that be? Hello, Elias and Duck. Hello, Assalamu Alaikum. It's Wise Old Duck. Oh, yeah. I'm wise. That is true. When you live this long, you can get wise pretty quickly. How are you doing this Ramadan so far? Alhamdulillah. We're doing fine. And we've made many new friends from all over the world. And we were going to talk to them about respect today. Oh, alhamdulillah. Respect is a very important topic. Take it from me. I've learned to respect things, people, environment, all throughout my years. And did you, let me just tell you a few things about respect that are very important to know. And I know you have a lot of kids watching, so kids, please pay attention as well, okay? Very, very important here. Respect starts at home. That's true. And first, with yourself, you must hold yourself high standards. Respect for your parents, your neighbors, and your teachers and others. Then you must show respect for people, for all living things. That's living things. And for the environment. So when you say respect for the environment, it's like not littering. So throwing the garbage in the garbage, not on the floor. We should also respect every human being, whether we know them or not, whether they are related to us or not, whether they are rich or whether they are poor. It doesn't matter. We are all created equal because we are all created by Allah. Alhamdulillah. And did you know that Allah commands us to respect and honor our parents in the Quran? That is absolutely true. Read it, and you will see. And did you also know that Prophet, Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, taught us that our mothers deserve the utmost respect? You have to listen to your mothers first, your mothers second, and your mothers third, all the time. And I would just say one few, few more things, Ilyas and Duct. Respect is one of the main ways to show good manners, like an op opening a door for someone, or helping someone with the groceries, or 
just being kind and saying please and thank you when somebody does something nice for you. It's a very good thing to do. And I'll say this one last thing. Respect means that we love and wish our, for our fellow humans what we wish for ourselves. That means if we want to be treated nicely, we treat others nicely. How does that sound to you? Thank you. That is so good to know, wise old duck. Thank you very much for teaching us about respect. That's wonderful. I have to go now. I have to read a few books and try to get some exercise. Just like you talked about or will talk about in one of your upcoming episodes. Okay, bye for now. Goodbye. Bye. Thank you, wise old duck. Friends, it's really important to remember that wise old duck said about respect. It can help you for your challenge later. Yes, it is. Respect is very important. And what uh, wise old duck told us uh, is very important. Points to remember, especially when you will be doing your challenge. I hear... Someone is calling again, but who could that be now? Yeah, that's weird. Hello? Hello? Yeah, Elias and Duck, how are you guys doing? Actually, I don't even mean to ask that question. I don't know why I did that. It's Mr. Meme. I, did you come here earlier before we started the show? Well, I was just wondering, why do you bother? Why do you bother telling all your friends about Ramadan and all the goodness in Ramadan and all these challenges? doesn't make any sense to me. It actually makes me mad well these challenges are important because we want our friends and ourselves to improve by the end of Ramadan so we want to focus every day on a special um, challenge and they've also been earning challenge cards no they will not I'm gonna make sure they don't because I'm Mr. Mean ha 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 but Mr. Mean, you should give it a try. I know deep down you have a good heart. Go ahead, give it a try. No, no, no. I do not have a good heart. Last I checked, it was not good at all. I am Mr. Mean. Oh, wait. What was that? No, I didn't want to do that. No way. That was a heart. You didn't see that. Nobody saw that. Nobody saw that. I have to go now. Okay, bye. See, even Mr. Mina has a heart. He just doesn't know it. We just want him to kind of improve and do a challenge every day, and he will be better by the end of Ramadan as well. Oh, I can't wait for Mr. Mean to be uh, to realize how Ramadan is a special month and one that he should take advantage of to get better and improve. Duck. Do you want to check and see the comments that we've been getting from our friends? Oh, but Elias, don't forget to check the comments. Yes, Tuck, you're right. We've gotten more comments from our friends and they are saying hello, so we should respond and say hello back because we're alive. So, Ibrahim is watching us and it says they that he likes the show and the four sisters from Dubai are reminding us of their names uh, Sunaina and Arneza and Haya and Sumaika Salaam Alaikum and, As and, and, oh, and the four is sisters also watching us. said that a little respect will give you many benefits and that's true and Doug um, Sharik is at uh, Lukman is asking, What is your favorite drink? Lukman asks, What's my favorite drink? Um, I'll get to that in another episode. Okay, 
We'll talk about that another time. But now it's time for the Arabic word of the day. Yay! Yay! I love it when we learn how to new how to say new words in Arabic. Friends, the Arabic word for today is ihtiram. Is ihtiram. ihtiram. It's the Arabic word for respect. Can you say it with us? Ah, ihtiram. 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 Very good. That's the word for respect in Arabic. Ilyas, what about the challenge? I didn't forget, Duck. You're right. Now we should tell our friends about the challenge that they will have to do at home. So now it's the challenge of the day, friends. Yay! Yay! Every episode, we've been talking about one thing that we can do to work on and improve ourselves this month. So at the end of that, when you watch each episode, we tell you that there is a fun challenge for you to try at home. And friends, remember, when you do the challenge, ask your parents to help take pictures or videos so you can send them to us because we love it when we get your videos and your pictures. It means that we're doing this together. So today's challenge is for you to demonstrate how you show respect to your parents or your elders at home. Take a short video of you or a picture doing this challenge and after you complete the challenge you will earn this challenge card. Look at that. It's me with the hat on the challenge card. And it's about showing respect. When you finish doing the challenge and you earn the challenge card, you can put it on your challenge chart. By now, you should have seven challenge cards on your challenge chart. Wow, it's been one week already, friends. Hey, Duck. Do you know now what time it is? Now do you know what time it is? Jingle time! Jingle time! Yay! Yay! Let's do it, Duck. And friends, okay. you watching us at home, you do it too. You know the words by now. Okay, I'll go first. There's no room for meanness. Only goodness in Ramadan. And when a good deed is done, the reward is multiplied. Not just once or twice. Not three times, nor four. But many, many. Many, many. Many, many times, times more. more. Thank you for watching us, friends. Ma salama. And Ma we'll salama. see you again tomorrow. Take care. See you next time. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum.